Well, welcome to the Five on Five. We are pleased to be joined today by Charlie Waddington, president of the Grants Pass Active Club. Charlie, thanks so much for being here. Thanks for having me. We are talking Boatnik, and it is right around the corner. Yep. For those who aren't familiar with what this event is, tell us a little bit about it. Well, Boatnik, this is our 59th year wow. um, of doing Boatnik. And what it is an event to raise money for kids in Josephine County. So all the money raised during this five-day event goes back to the kids in Josephine County, and we give back all year long. Very cool. Now, there's a variety of events. We've got mm -hmm. the boat races. Uh, to talk to us a little bit about what people can expect over these five days. Well, we're going to start. Uh, we basically take over the park tomorrow, and then we're going to start setting everything up. Thursday will be family day. Um, that's uh, no alcohol in the park, so families can come in and do the rides and all that on Thursday. Uh, Friday, we uh, full scale. All the vendors will be in to play and doing all that. Uh, the rides will be going. We do have um, a concert happening Friday night for the first time. Okay, that's something White. new. Yeah, Great White. There was a big band back in the 80s. And they'll be there at 6 o'clock up at the upper baseball field in the park. And then the fireworks will be at uh, about 9.30 on Friday night. Okay. And then through the rest of the weekend, we have the boat races. We have the sprint boats, the drag boats going Saturday and Sunday. The fireworks again on Sunday night. Um, and Saturday, we do have the parade, which is a big one. Yeah. Going down. Um, and then uh, on Monday, we have Memorial Day service and the hydroplane race. Okay. Mm -hmm. And the weather looks like it's going to cooperate. Yes. I mean, could you ask for better weather coming into this event? <laughs> no, that's, oh, we're always worried about that. And last year, we had uh, beautiful weather for the whole weekend and uh, were able to raise uh, actually a record for us last year. So I think um, this year, with the weather cooperating, we'll be able to do it again. Well, we've got much more to talk about, Charlie, but we're going to take a quick break. We'll be right back. Welcome back. We are pleased to be joined once again by Charlie Waddington, president of the Grants Pass Active Club, here to talk about the 59th annual Boatnik. How exciting. You must be really excited that it's just around the corner. Very excited. So we were uh, talking all about all the different events that are going to be taking place, one of those being the fireworks. Uh, mm -hmm. Just last week we were talking about how the 4th of July fireworks display wouldn't be able to happen because of renovations at right. the fairgrounds. This is where you can get your fireworks fixed. Talk a little bit about what that experience is like, having those fireworks over the river. It's incredible. Um, just... We do it both on Friday and Sunday night, and uh, there's nothing like it having the fireworks go up all over the river. You can stand up on the bridge and look, or be on the shoreline and looking, and it's just a fantastic opportunity to see those fireworks up and close. And like you said, we're not going to have them this year for 4th of July, so you get them two nights if you want. And I imagine the only thing that would prevent fireworks would be weather, but it just looks like the weather's going to be amazing. Right, it is. Okay, and we kind of gave them the rundown before the break about all the events. Hopefully they were taking notes, but mm -hmm. if they weren't, where can you get a schedule and, and any more information? Well, we have flyers out with a schedule in it, and most of our sponsors, and we have about 138 or so sponsors this year. Wow. Yes, and we can't do this without the sponsors. They're the ones that help us put this on. But flyers there, we also have boatnick.com, and that's what we encourage people to go to is boatnick.com has the schedule there and um, if you uh, one of the big things we'd like to talk about is the armbands okay. uh, pre-sale of armbands uh, they are $26 pre-sale and 31 at the park so you're going to save a good amount if you get them ahead of time okay and again boatnick.com or lily pantry has those for sale and the armband gets you in Get the armband. No, it's all free. The weekend is free. There you the go. The armband is for the rides. It okay. gives you a full day of rides. Nice. Mm -hmm. Okay. So if you're one of those people who just needs to go on as many as possible, you want to get that armband. Well, you have those kids. You yes. just want to go on all of them, you know. <laughs> Excellent. And anything that I missed that you want to make sure we touch on? No, just come down and enjoy a wonderful, wonderful experience at Boatnik. Um, and again, Memorial Day, that's a big event there. We have uh, uh, wreath laying and everything there, the service, and then, yes, we're going to have the flyover again. So we'll have a jet flying over at least one. We're hoping for two. Excellent. Well, Charlie, thanks so much for being here. Thank you. We'll be right back.